long press hard button to on and off your watch, smart watch. <laughs> long press clock button to do all the setting for your smart watch on the lower left hand side. And here you can make a Bluetooth uh, pairing with your Glucose Genius. Uh, choose the number 4 wireless setting, Bluetooth, and my device. And choose the second option, Blood Glucose Meter, and then search for a new device. And you can see uh, the smartwatch has found item DM. And you press it. Now it's connected. Uh, swipe left and press the heart to enter the blood pressure, SPO2, and heartbeat monitor. Uh, you can uh, pause or play to activate the sensor is right behind the smartwatch it takes about 20 seconds to almost a minute to capture your reading Right now you can see that the smartwatch has completed the detection and all the test results is being shown. The upper value is systolic blood pressure, the lower value is diastolic blood pressure. On the right we have blood oxygen saturation SpO2 and on the bottom we have the beats per minute which is your heartbeat. So we can press the pause icon to stop the sensor detection. On the lower left um, you can press the humor icon to do simple adjustment to your uh, personal data so as to improve the sensor accuracy. Uh, you can choose gender, age, and your health status, and then confirm. And you can save. From the main menu, we swipe down, and then uh, we will reach the step counter. Uh, apart from a step counter, we have a calorie count and also a distance count. Uh, when you press the play button, it will start counting the, uh, the distance which the wearer has covered. Oh, thank you. So I took a small walk in the office and you can see the test result. Uh, this is uh, how long I have traveled and how many steps I have taken and also uh, how much calories I have burnt from the my steps walk. Um, swipe your main screen up and we can see this is your uh, average health data test results and also the previous last uh, test result timing that you have taken. Uh, this is uh, your upper and lower blood pressure and here is your Heartbeat, and this is the time where the wearer has last taken the test. Uh, to test your blood glucose, press the hub button on the upper left, and then uh, you can press the middle icon to start a test. Here, you are required to input your meal timing. I will put two hours and swipe left and press the tick to start the test. Make sure your device is switched on before you press OK. You know, the watch is currently detecting the Glucose Genius device. And you can put in your finger and press OK. So the test uh, will take about one minute. 
and you can just relax your finger and rest lightly on the device. So the sound will uh, tell you that the test is completed, you can remove your finger. So similarly, uh, you can see here is your upper and lower blood pressure. On the upper right uh, is your heartbeat and on the bottom middle value is your blood glucose. Uh, currently it is in MGDL, uh, you can convert it to MMOL value as well. I'll press the heart shape button to go back to the main menu. You can also edit your personal particulars uh, from the person icon here. Uh, similarly, you can change your uh, gender, age, um, your height and weight, and also your uh, health status, whether you are type 2 or normal diabetes, and also a reference HbA1c value, uh, which you have tested in the hospital during your uh, three months checkup uh, after, after everything is uh, confirmed and we can save